hey guys welcome back to the channel now for today's video i'm hoping that this video will help somebody who is thinking of moving to qatar or might already be here but not quite sure as to what type of housing to get and just to get the general idea of how much uh, accommodation actually costs in qatar so for today's video we are going to take a look at a couple of houses actually apartments and we are going to start off with a one bedroom house and then sorry one bedroom apartment and then move on to a two bedroom tomorrow we have another viewing but i'm not quite sure if that is finalized or not but i will keep you informed and you will see everything in this video this will be like a series so we are going to show you different types of apartments and villas and so on here in Qatar. So do stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe. I think she'll love the view. Doesn't matter if it's small. <laughs> so is the same screening also included? Uh, it's, uh, how, how much they give you the rate? 7,000. 7,000? Yeah. yeah. So you have a housekeeping here, it's at twice a week. And then you have also card parking free, internet, all the utility features, including your data. And then you have access to swimming pool and gym. Oh, OK. The gym is on which floor? Last floor. Okay. You have all oh. accessories. Kitchen area, you have washing machine, all the kitchen accessories. Oh, it's all included. All included. Okay. Full furniture. Just you have to buy your grocery. Yeah. It's convenient. Especially for somebody who's new in the yeah. country. Freeze and freezer. Oh. Wow. And this is the... The only thing that's not here is a microwave. Yes. And a dishwasher. And dishwasher. Does it have a tub? No, no tub. No. Okay. Shower. Just the shower. So nobody comes daily to. Yeah, yeah no. no Just twice, twice a week. Twice a week only. Okay, okay. Thank you. So this 
is the front door. And we've got a little bit of an entryway over here where you can have, it's actually not too small. So this is the sitting room, which is actually quite spacious. You've got your, and it is fully furnished. This is a two bedroom apartment, fully furnished. So that's one thing you don't need to worry about, especially if you're new to the country. So you've got your, I'm not sure if they are going to change the furniture or if this is what you are going to get, but this is just how it is right now. You have your TV, AC, fully functional. This is your dining area. So we've got other things here. We've made ourselves at home. So this is your dining area and we're gonna move to this side where you have the first bedroom. So as you can see, as I mentioned, it is fully furnished. So all of this you will get when you move in. The only thing that you will need to buy for yourself, obviously, is just your linen, which is not a problem because this apartment is literally three minutes away from an Almira and a Lulu's hypermarket. So which are two of the most used and popular supermarkets in Qatar. So you will be set. So your wardrobes at the side, very spacious as well. So you can put your, all your things this side. You've got a nice mirror for us people who like to see ourselves all the time. Does it open this side? You have more than enough space. You've got your side tables over here. And it looks like it comes with the gym as well. So that is a big plus. And you've got your drawers here with a mirror as well. So let's move on to the first bathroom, which is like your powder room, kind of. So that's your toilet, the first toilet. And from the corridor, from the main bedroom, we come to this side, which is going to be the main bathroom which is actually not very big, <laughs> no tub at all. And this is what I've noticed with most apartments in Qatar, that they don't usually come with the tub, or if they do, the tub is actually quite small. So that's one thing that you need to think of and be in mind. So you've got your standing shower over here, toilet, sink. And as you can see, when I say this is not big at all, look, I'm actually touching both walls. So but I suppose for the price, it's worth it. And this is the second bedroom. So you've got your two single beds, but I mean, it's actually quite spacious. So yeah, so if you've got kiddies, this will be the perfect room for them. The view is not really something to look at, but it's better than nothing. And then this is your wardrobe space. So, it's not bad, not bad at all. And this apartment is 6,000 Qatar Reals, and I will tell you more about what is included later on. And this is your kitchen, which has everything that you need. So you've got your stove, your washing machine. Does it have a dishwasher? No, no dishwasher. But I mean, we've got more than enough drawers. So, and it comes with the fridge as well. So, yeah, so this is the second apartment. In comparison to the first one, let me know what you think in the description box. Which one do you prefer? But do bear in mind that the pricing is very different. So, you actually get what you pay for. So, tomorrow we are going to have a look at the third and last apartment. So, I'll see you tomorrow. Wow. Very spacious. Yeah. Six bedrooms. Six bedrooms. Six bedrooms. You need it, you know, you need it. Yeah. 
Yeah. Then, but if you want to turn it off all the time, it can go 1500. Um, okay. Yeah. And this is, yeah, this will be like. And this is a not finished, right? Not finished. Not finished. And it's not ready, they'll do the maintenance. Okay, okay. Before you move it. Like furniture will be polished, clean. Yes, yes. Like that. I'm just looking at the AC because in our last place the AC was a problem. Yeah, it's okay. Good yeah. Okay, this is another bedroom. Yes. Oh, onto, okay. Yeah. With its own bathroom. Bedroom. So three three bedrooms come with a dark bath comes with and this two share common. Oh. Okay. And is there a bedroom with the I mean bathroom with the tub or they all shower? They all shower. They all shower. Okay. Tub is here. Oh there is share. a tub. Oh nice. Tub is for everyone. Yes, because you hardly get um yeah, I Villas or apartments with. Really only for master bedroom, rest of people try it. Yeah. yeah. It's nice to at least have one tub. Yeah. This is another bedroom. That's what's in the money we see in Hassan, just a tab. Everywhere. Everywhere, it's just tabs. showers. So on this floor, it's three bedrooms. Four. Four bedrooms. Two one. Two oh, okay, okay. And then there's one still one more? Yeah. Okay, let me go. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Where are you guys from? South Africa. South Africa. Yeah. You like cricket? Sorry? You like cricket? I like rugby. You like rugby? I like rugby. Yeah. yeah. You play rugby? Size for up here. Like, is it proper bedroom? Maybe yeah. With the dash bar. Because usually the, there's one small bedroom, but actually all of them yeah. are good size good bedrooms. Size. Yeah. Yeah. They're all good size and bedrooms. And four of the bedrooms are with the dash bar. Yeah. That's good. Or only one bedroom, yeah. Only yeah. two, two bedrooms are sharing oh. the width. Yeah, 
Well, thank you so much for Don't showing worry. us. Hey, girl. Can we just talk? Talk about where we're going before we get lost. Can we just talk? Figure out where we're going.